the skull, first put on display in the Gallery of Alaska in 1980, came to the UA Museum of the North in 1969. In preparation for the articulation and suspension of the skeleton from the museum's lobby ceiling, the skull was slid onto a mobile cart and driven carefully through the gallery. Several displays were shifted slightly, leaving just enough room for the skull to make the journey to the museum's loading dock, where it was brought to ground level. The skull remained in the garage for a couple months while the museum staff waited and took advantage of the odd warm day in August and September to clean and re-clean the bones and let them dry in the sun. Dish soap and warm water removed much of the remaining oil.